we get there, we've planned, we've rehearsed, and we've done all our shit. And I, um, I'm running the primary breach on the first floor. I go up and over the gate. I should probably start off with, uh, we swam in. So that's a whole different set of problems. Um, we swam in a, uh, a slaughterhouse offshoot. Um, so you can imagine all the great white sharks. That's a real fucking thing. Um, that's the fastest I ever swam in my life. <laughs> so we swam in, we do our whole thing. I go up and over um, and I'm messing around with the locking mechanism on the gate to try to get it open. And there's a string going from the gate. It looks like it's going inside. Um, and now I think that was a, an early warning device. Um, I think it was hooked to a bell. It was hooked to something. Um, we get the gate open. We bring everybody in. And as we are rolling up to the front door, they start getting contacted on the roof. Guy comes out, shoots, skips off one of the guy's helmet. Now the firefighting suits. And it's three stories. And it's getting fucking chaotic, dude. Like, they have been prepping for this for a long fucking time. And this is not a beachside bungalow. There's a... Uh, there's no doors. They're all walled up from the inside. There's nothing to attack. You can't see anything. It's like I'm trying to get the door open, but you don't know where the hinges are. You don't know what it is. It's this huge, um, super thick door. Fuck, man. It probably must have been six inches thick. So it's a fucking fortress. It's a fucking fortress, dude. It's a fucking, it's a literal fortress. Um, they start getting contact on the roof, and we sprint up the front door. And as we go to divide, this dude opens up on the front door and lets it go. And just you just see splinters of wood and it just fucking traces us and doesn't hit anybody. We roll to either side and now we're trying to deal with this problem. Um, the hate coming out of that front door was nothing like I've ever seen. It just continuous ascending it. And the way it, it ended up being was a long wall, the door in the center. I'm on one side and I've got um, my shooting buddy on the other side. And I've got my team leader behind me. And we're trying to figure this out. Like, we have to get inside. But we're not supposed to kill this dude. That was the whole thing. Is, for whatever reason, the powers to be really wanted this dude alive. And the last thing they told us before we went. I, I would rather you shoot him a hundred times and he lives than shoot him one time and he dies. Bring him back alive. Well, I'm fucking committed. We all are. We're going to bring that dude back alive. We came up with every plan we could have. Um... And at the end of the day, if you don't want to be captured, you're not capturing, dude. You're just not. Um, especially in that part of the world, with just how violent they are. I mean, you've seen Black Hawk Down. That's the most realistic war movie I've ever fucking watched. That's exactly how it is. They are fucking... <laughs> and they come on quick. So we're in this, we're in this shit storm in the middle of the door. <laughs> and I'm trying to decide how I'm going to blow this thing. I've got my charge in my hand. It's already capped in. Um, I've got my hydrogel peeled 